Hey everybody, this is Grace. It might jump around a little bit, but it, it sometimes stops after a while. It has a stabilizer, my video, my camera, but it makes it too close. When I use it, but sometimes it'll stop by itself. But anyway, um, I'm on my way to go to a Dollar Tree. I haven't been to this one since sometime last year. This is close to the end of March 2022. And I went sometime last year. I had this uh, rare adrenal disorder and I was pretty much at home for much of 2020 and 2021. And I had like a two and a half month period I could go and I just didn't feel like going much. <laughs> I think I went once. I didn't feel like going much of anywhere. And uh, I guess I'd gotten used to not going and during that time we had our so much stuff delivered like groceries and whatever else we could we needed and uh, which I did not like I was not at all impressed by it at all really uh, overall the experiences were not good and uh, even pickup wasn't good you know I, more recently when we had done one this year I don't know how many we did this year but one of them, we got like 50% of what we ordered, or maybe even less. So I wasn't impressed. Okay, and it wasn't just that we didn't get much of what we ordered. It was just the way some of them just, you know, like one delivered everything. We had leave it door, you know, and he, you know, was trying to get us to come out and check every bag. And it was, it was a bad scene, you know. It was like, uh-uh, you know, you do your job right, mister. And, uh, I'm not paying for it, but, you know, getting things that were wrong. Boy, this sounds like a big old rant, huh? <laughs> anyway, I'm going to go to this Dollar Tree and, you know, see what, um, I have a whole lot of things I want to buy. Like, one of them is a lock. You know, those old-fashioned locks, you know, like, I don't know what you call them. Um... You know, it's like a, it's got a, uh, what do we, how would you even describe it? <laughs> like you move the little thing over and then it clicks into, you know, like a little hole. You know, that those old fashioned ones. It's for a door that is, it's not exactly a bay window, but you know, the doors that just don't have locks on them and I need one on it. And I don't want, in the, the door handles, you can't put a lock in there. Um, they're too small. Yeah, so I want one of those, and uh, for one door, it's to the front of the to the front of the house because we have such trouble with the dogs wanting to go out whenever I go out or he goes out the front door. And just as I left to go, I tried to make my escape, and one of them busted through. You know, I have something around it, uh, trying to hold it closed. He busted through that, and then he attacked me. And I have one of my fingers is hurt, and of course that's the finger he scratches. And I'm like, really, you know? <laughs> he, he he's bad. He's he's bad. He's a uh, American pit bull um, terrier, American pit pit bull terrier, and he is just he doesn't understand no. He does not understand no. That's the only dog I can ever recall that would not learn no, or you know that learn not to do something he just does it he just does and I love him to death but oh my goodness that was that was very annoying for me and uh, but anyway I'd hoped to get out and go to the store without a big drama <laughs> or what hopefully not while I'm there there's not gonna be a big drama the other day I went to uh, 99 cents only store and it's kind of big but it's not as big as the Dollar Tree that we have a really huge Dollar Tree here and uh, I know there's bigger ones so nobody needs to tell me but the last time I ever first time I ever mentioned or one of the times I mentioned that we you know the store somebody says well there's a bigger one and you know there's always that kind of party pooper you know the one that's like I say oh it's so hot in Texas no, I live in Texas somebody says well it's hotter in you know <laughs> You know that type, ooh, yucky. 
yucky type of people to me. Anyway, but I went to the 99 cent store and store. Of course, you know, there was something. It was outside of it, I think. I don't know. I don't remember. I made a video, but I put it on a different channel. And I said, why am I doing that? And, uh, and it took me a long while. So I had to move it to hopefully the channel I've decided to use more. And I've said that so many times. And every time I say that, something comes up. It keeps me from doing that. As usual. But anyway, um, there's all. It, it's, it's like I don't like to use the word always and these kinds of things. You know, I don't like it, like it when people do that always and never, the black and white kind of thinking. Um, it's always got to be always. <laughs> I thought it was funny too. But anyway, no, I, I don't like that. But most often, I can I can't really recall. In many times, if any, I can't really call, recall any right now. When I've gone to some place, not just this store, but any store, and uh, there's an any now, but um, gone to one and there not be some kind of drama, whether it's me included, like somebody's trying to start something. Woo! You see my car move more, drove for me. But that or uh, some kind of drama. That happens to me, or somebody, and or other people. You know, just other people. You know, it's like because there's usually this at least one person. I've said that for many, many years. There's at least that one you know, that that's going to cause some kind of problem or things that they own the store and everybody better move out of their way. And <laughs> oh my goodness. And but anyway. So what else was I going to talk about? No big old drama in the middle of the street. What in the heck is it me trying to do? But, um, yeah, I haven't been here all this time. Hopefully this car doesn't run out in front of me. But, uh, I have a lot of things I need to buy. I just want, I want to take my time. But I know the longer I'm in there, there's actually a social theory uh, about what, the more a person goes out and, you know, this kind of thing. Well, I can certainly understand that. I am on the right road, huh? I'm serious, I haven't been, I haven't been out much, you know, because of my rare adrenal disorder, and uh, I listen to the scientists, and, uh, okay, this could have been yellow and I could have gone, it's not yellow, come on, there's nobody coming, <laughs> maybe they had too many wrecks right here at this place, well, all the other people going. But, uh, yeah, I want to go there and buy a few things, so. Okay, you know, I would say, like, so many people talk about these days. Oh, the prices, the cost of gas is so high. I am going to say this. <laughs> these are not as high as compared during uh, the last uh, Bush, okay, era. Uh-uh. No. So, this this crap, people say, oh, it's crap. You know, I can remember... I. I was lucky back then because I was working in it and the, my job involved me driving my car quite a bit and I, luckily I had a car that was a stick shift, a little tiny car that was a stick and because uh, I wasn't earning all that much anyway, I was, I was making enough but uh, yeah, I, I wasn't with Adam at the time and uh, but still, the gas was expensive. That 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 little car got great mileage, though. And uh, but anyway, you know, like I said, this, this the, the gas prices I remember they were at or even above maybe the prices now. Yeah. So, but people have too many people. Not everybody, but too many have to make such a big old deal out of something and start pointing fingers and da, 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 da. just did they not have a life <laughs> you know <laughs> have to do that really do you have to do that is that your life it's pointing fingers like that and I know that me pointing fingers at you pointing fingers at somebody is me pointing fingers at you <laughs> it's the purpose behind it though you know I keep trying to get that a point across in some of my videos about like the people who are narcissistic, um, you know, they do stuff like that, and, and 
it doesn't have to be any kind of certain way, but they're going to want to be the center of attention. They are know-it-alls and all that stuff. And then uh, basically they'll, they'll point the finger at people if they do the same exact thing. Okay, they'll point a finger at somebody saying, oh, that person isn't, you know, uh, has poor hygiene. And so do they. Okay. And to point it out, you know, of course, that's going to get, you know, a good possibility people start watching your ha your habits, you know, just so they can disprove you or something. But, um, you know, say, well, so do you. <laughs> you know that type? Yeah. So do you. Right. And it's hotter in other states. <laughs> God. Oh, I'm telling you, I'm on a roll today. But, uh, yeah, I mean, I know that, that they can turn it around on you, and I'm well aware that nobody's perfect. I'm certainly not perfect. I am certainly not perfect. And I, But I don't use it as an excuse to go and do stuff wrong, even though I know better. Yeah. See I'm t what I'm saying? It's the purpose behind it. But if you point out somebody saying, well, you have those uh, bad hygiene habits, that the person who's complaining about somebody and they, they're doing it constantly like projection, it's projection. You know, I don't have bad hygiene habits, by the way. You know, but we all make mistakes. And I'm, I'm very careful about that, but I've seen people do this. People who do things, I'm going to be gross for a second, a few seconds or minutes here. But they do things like they rub their nose itches, okay? And they rub their nose or, or their you know, have a runny hose, and they rub it on the back of their hand. No tissue. No tissue. No cloth, nothing. No handkerchief, nothing. And they rub it on the back of their hands, and they're driving down the road, going to a store, and then they show themselves dipping their hands in stuff that same hands are doing with their finger in their ears, and then touching all this stuff. Ugh. And, it's, and they do it on, can, can't they see it when they do it on camera? Can't they see what they're doing? And then they talk bad about people who are, you know, aren't, people, other people doing it. What they're doing it themselves. If I sit in every video, I don't I'm hardly ever on camera. But if I did and I was doing that stuff and then I talked about people, that's a difference. But I don't. I don't do it at all. Before I go into any place or even hand my credit card over to somebody, you know, like a drive-thru, I, I clean it. I have these little um, cleaning things right here in my car. Yeah. I'm not saying I'm perfect. <laughs> I'm not. But th what I'm talking about is a hypocrisy. You know, when somebody does that. So, I'm on a roll, let me tell you, about this kind of stuff. Yeah. Okay. You know, let me give an example. It would be a bit like, and this is the road, isn't it? I'm not sure. But it would be a bit like if I were to complain about somebody driving down the road making videos. I've been doing this for years, by the way. I've been driving for 40-something years. And I've been making videos driving probably seven years. And that, but I'm not perfect. <laughs> but it would be, it would be as if I did something like that. You know, complain about somebody driving down the road, making videos, yet I do it. Okay? Then you could point your finger at me and say, hey, you know, you do realize you do the same thing. Okay? There's one. Now, if I complain about somebody driving down the, the um, road making videos, and they were looking at the camera and reading, reading what was, like they're doing live stream or something, and they were reading it while they were driving, I don't do that. Okay, I don't do that. So if I said that person does that, that's different. And I shouldn't have to, I don't have to explain this. I guess many people uh, are in, get it. But yeah, I've seen people, you know, things like that. They do very similar things, the same kind of offensive things, yet they complain. Like I said, I can go ahead. Oh, he's going back there. But, uh,. Like I said, I don't drive down the road looking at my camera because I don't do live streams as it is uh, while I'm driving down the road. So, anyway.